All right, what I'd like to do is show you guys how to divide polynomials using long division. Um, first thing we got to write is what we have is we have a binomial uh, that we're trying to divide into a trinomial. So we're going to use long division for this format. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the first term of our binomial and we're just going to say how many times is it going to go into our first term of the trinomial. And you can say, well, x goes into 2x cubed, 2x squared. And the other way you can kind of look at this is just kind of do a side division of it. 2x cubed divided by x, well, that's going to be 2. That's going to cancel out, and you'll be left with 2x squared. So now what I have to do is I can't go, I can't divide my 4 into my x because there's no x with the 4, and I can't go into any other term. So now I'm going to, the main important thing is once I, uh, divided my first term in. I can't divide my second term in. So now I'm going to have to multiply, but you got to make sure you multiply times both terms. So 2x times 2x squared is going to be 2x cubed. And 2x squared times 4 is going to give you a 8x squared. Now the main important thing is, which we notice is, we do not have a x squared in this term. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to substitute in a 0x squared. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to write a 0x squared plus 6x plus 152. Because essentially, 0 times x squared is 0x squared. Now, what we have to do is we have to subtract. And remember, we're subtracting this whole line. So I'm going to put parentheses around it just so you guys can remember that you have to subtract each and every term. So therefore now I obtain, that's become a zero x cubed, which has become a zero, and this becomes a negative eight x squared. Now, x goes into negative x squared, negative eight x times, negative eight x times x becomes a negative eight x squared, negative eight, uh, eight x times four is a negative 32. Bring down my 6x. And remember that's a positive 6x. So again, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to subtract my whole line. That makes this a positive, so this becomes a 0x x, uh, x squared. This becomes a positive, which is, that's a, I'm sorry, this is a x, right? A 32x. Um, that becomes a positive, so now I'm going to have a 38 x x goes into 38x 38 times 38 times x is 38x 38 times 4 well 38 plus 38 is going to be 76 right and 76 times 2 would be 152 so that's going to be a positive 152 I drop down my 152, make sure I subtract everything in the side. The reason why I put parentheses is because the biggest mistake that students make is they forget to distribute that negative sign to both terms. I drop it down, and then this becomes zero. So our main, my remainder is zero, so my final answer. So remember, um, so that's how you divide polynomials using long division.